What's good, TTC? Y'all know what it is. D1 Chosen, Finn Squad, Enforcer here. And I'm here to grow up to the um to these Patriots. There was nothing much to say about this game from when we first punted and my punter, who has been the special teams player of the week twice so far, start shaking punts. I already knew what time it is. I already knew. It was a horrible, horrible game. Offense, defense, special teams, just outplayed, outcoached, um, just just everything. Um, it was a horrible display. Got beat 38-7. to Um the Patriots really came in with the game plan. They 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 added to the game plan that the Raiders used against us. Their defense used against the offense by pressing our receivers because yes, they are fast as fuck, but they are short. The only tall receiver we have that beats that could beat press coverage regularly is Devontae Parker, and he was out for the game. Uh, but anyway, um. The Patriots are two and two. The Dolphins are three and one. We still got our tilt in Miami, and we all know how hard it is in fucking Foxborough. It is still hard to beat these bitches in Foxborough, but we all know when y'all come to Miami, y'all know what time it is. And Tyson, I expect that. I love how Tyson hasn't done a crow to the Dolphins in like three years. Whenever we play them in Miami, he never shows up. So I expect him not to show up this year when we play him in Miami. But anyway, um. Y'all outclasses today and show that y'all still have a little fight left in y'all. I don't, I mean, I don't, you know, I was telling people that, you know, yeah, I expect y'all dynasty is dwindling down, but y'all motherfuckers still going to be hard to beat in fucking Foxborough. Um, I congrats y'all on that win. Um, it kept y'all alive. Y'all couldn't fall one and three. One and three would have been a death knell for you, Patriot, for y'all Patriots. Um, I mean... Us Dolphins and Dolphin players, we got to lick our wounds. We got nicked up a lot. We've been, we're missing Rashard Jones. We're really feeling that William Hayes. I already knew I was going to really feel William Hayes being injured. But Rashard missing the last two games have really showed in the back end of our defense. I hope he comes back real soon. We got the Bengals next week. We got to lick our wounds. Go back to um, Go back to what we need to be doing. And shit like that, because it was just a disgust. Like, you learned nothing from yesterday. You learned nothing from yesterday. It was pure domination from opening kickoff. From opening kickoff. A lot of dumb shit happened. The center got injured, injured his arm or something like that. The backup center goes in there, fucking throws the ball over Tannehill's head. I mean, it was just one bad showing after everything bad happening after another. Um... So, congrats, Patriots, on y'all win. Y'all still alive. I mean, like I said, one and three would have been would have been a, a a hole, but the AFC is weak. It possibly could have done anything with one and three. Shit, I was one and four a few years ago and made the fucking playoffs. So, but for divisional purposes, yes, going down one and three against the Dolphins who were three and zero at the time, that would have been a little hole. But anyway, I congratulate y'all on the win. Um. I was really impressed with Sony Mitchell. I actually liked him coming out. Um, he actually he did his thing. Y'all actually y'all saw y'all attacked our weakness. Well, which which was a strength, y'all. You know, Belichick found a weakness. He stuck to the run game, and y'all had a great rushing effort from James White and Sony Mitchell. And um, that's all I gotta say. Um, this is D one chosen Finn Squad Enforcer. Congratulations, Patriots fans, on y'all win. Um. I'll see y'all later on this week for us. See, um, Bengals hate me. I'm out.